everyone. Happy greetings to all the <coughs> citizens. Happy New Year to you all. We are sailing through a troubled periods, and I'm sure we have opportunity to learn something out of this disaster unfolding in front of our eyes. My predecessors who spoke earlier about the importance of prayer, I admire this sankalpa and prayer. They are wonderful things. But the great Swami Vivekananda, during his times while he was walking around this Pavitra Bhumi of India, he saw, he saw so much of pain, so much of misery, so much of hunger. He said, the people of my country, they really don't need God at the moment. They need food. At this hour, we need treatments. It is weakness on our part to offer prayer instead of serving the humanity. Prayers are great. But what am I doing? Prayer should be the last resort. This is my belief. When my mother is sick, is it okay that I go to a corner in my meditation room? I offer prayers to God. Please, God, look after my mother. Please help her. Will it be good? No. I'll have to take actions in my hands. I'll have to do something. I'll have to call doctor. Likewise, there are many innocent people around us. There are many citizens around us who are suffering. We can help. Of course, we have embargo. We have been isolated from the rest of the society. But wherever possible, it is an opportunity to serve the people. Time for worship. We always have time for worship. This is a golden opportunity for us to worship in whichever faith you have. Such opportunities, God knows when we little repeat again. See, while we were working, going to our offices, didn't we crave that, oh my God, I wish I had some holidays so I can spend time with my family, with my children. I wish I had time in studying some holy literature. Well, this is the time we have. But depending on prayers, when there is a warlike situation, it's okay to pray. It's okay to make sankalpas. It's okay to have group meditations. I love that. But besides that, I would also need to extend my help services. All the heartfulness members all across the globe, they're collecting funds. They're also serving more than 25 to 30,000 meals a day to those who are needing. So I wish many people will join hands and serve the needy. It's, it's a clarion call. How during troubled times we can come together and help each other, especially those who cannot be helped. So with a lot of prayers to you all, my prayers to God Almighty, that let us all become serving citizens during the times when they need the most. Thank you. Thank you for listening. Thank you.